Sure, if you want. If it takes good, I don't mind. I think it'll go. I think it'll do. We're not going to be doing a whole lot of typing anyways. It's an adventure game. Okay. Hi, guys! Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Dirk Kovica here with... Brad! Brad! Did you forget your name? No, not this time. <laughs> okay, guys, so we're here with some Sherlock Holmes. I posted on Twitter if you guys thought it would be a fun idea to do some uh, Brentlock Holmes and Mon Watsovica. And you all said yes, surprisingly. So, <laughs> yeah, so. It's not uh, surprising at all. Not surprising at all? No, not at all. Let's begin. Yep, let's begin. Fish tank. I know next to nothing Fancy about this game, tank. except that it's apparently made by... A frog. A frog. A frog has made this game. Oh my. The testament of Sherlock Holmes. Oh. All right, get those papers. Well, I can do nothing as no, of right now. No, get those papers. I can't do anything. What's happening? Okay. Stop changing the camera. Go get those papers. <laughs> those right there. Is that you? That's not me. That's. Does that look like Sherlock Holmes? You, I thought you were Watson. Does that look like Sherlock Holmes or Watson? Could be. Obviously, that's me and that's you. What oh. the hell? What was that sound? <laughs> oh, my God. What... These are like, la, 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 la. what are these sounds? What's this? Baby face here. Yeah, seriously. These are like the most... Okay. <laughs> He's a fucking airplane. Now. That's how you play. kids? Ugh. Apparently ugly. Look. It's Watson. Oh my gosh, it is. It's, it's a metaphor Holmes for what Watson. what Watson really is. Well, Sherlock's over well, there puppet. too. Puppet. Sherlock's in the corner. Oh. They're both there. They're both puppets. <laughs> <laughs> Breaks it. Oh jeez, kid, don't mess with me. Oh, he broke me. Wow. Ah. What'd you think would have happened? Ooh. Your face is uh -oh. a little uglier. Oh, oh. There's something inside of Watson's body. Inside of his butt. He got jammed oh, up his look. butt. It's a book. Wait, who said that? The girl? I yeah, I think it was the Maybe girl. Maybe it's a book about pirates with a treasure map. Sure. What is with these children's faces? They look demented no, like they've I seen some shit. So. Look at that face! What? Oh my god, what was that? That unibrow? She looked like she was I about to try and kill her. I seen through all your lives. Oh, start from <laughs> the beginning, not this the lip -sync. middle. Seriously, what Where is going on right now? It's made in Japan. And so I decided to pick up my pen to relate the most disturbing episode of my life thus far. So she it just randomly... Early one morning in 1898, when Sherlock Holmes invited voice. me to accompany him... Okay, but seriously, like, three five-year-olds are reading the memoirs of Dr. John Watson? They ain't gonna stand shit. <laughs> Watson, my dear fellow. We can now go and inform <laughs> you that we have found the Samoan <laughs> necklace, and very means. much faster than Inspector Bates. This doesn't look like Sherlock. Pleases me. Have you really Not the Sherlock we the know. Holmes, and so quickly? I have indeed, Watson. And like believe Watson me, it's completely the same unnecessary like every to spread out. Right? They always go for the same type of person for Watson. Was best. He likes to boast that his methods are equal He always has to be mine, shorter than Sherlock, once too. Again, the Sherlock seems a bit the same. Yeah. After all these years, Seems kind of snakeish, doesn't he? I thought yeah. that by now I should be reasonably capable That's of with the statue with the, that Vivi on it. Case, just decided to grow on that, that statue. I don't understand just by anything at all. It's fig. Ah, you see, but you do not observe, Watson. There lies the I'm difference. watching our voice it levels as compared course. to theirs. Hello. A matter of course. In the a matter of course. Of course. Night, when of course. Is fast asleep, the service bell within that room rings out and alerts the servants. Oh, this is servants. probably important. They dress quickly and come running. But the door is locked and there is a strong smell of burning from within. A few seconds What's later, with your lips, the master Watson? of the house himself, Upgraded the textures. Bob Marchioness's husband, the Marquis they of loaded. Cunningham, Who is he arrives at? and unlocks the door. Me, I guess. Using the sole key. No, he's not. He's looking straight past us. A fire has started inside the room, but they have managed to arrive in time to put it out. 
It is at that moment that the Marquis realizes that the famous Marquis? Samoan necklace, Marquis? which had been Marquis. safe within its glass cabinet only a few hours no, Marquis. earlier, has now Marquis. Uh, Marquis. In order to explain, let us confirm my theory before the arrival of Inspector Baines. What theory? My theory. Uh... I miss ninety percent of it. Oh, hello. You control oh. Sherlock Holmes. Oh, wow. okay. All right. Look at the broken showcase and click on it. Jesus Christ, Sherlock. This window was cut with a diamond. It's a window. A oh. clean, discreet piece of work. This is Damn. where the necklace was. See how window. tiny the hole is, and not <laughs> one finger tiny. Oh on my. The you can you always interact with that. After your clues examine, the icon will turn green. Please move Sherlock Holmes near the left window. Oh, oh this one. All the yeah. windows. Let's are look locked. at this one. They've not been forced. Right? Yeah, that one. Oh, well, look at it. Undoubtedly made by a diamond. Someone tried to cut the glass, but he Maybe was interrupted. Therefore, yeah. the thief tried to escape through the window. But he was interrupted. It's pretty shitty cut. Yeah, seriously, it's some some dude needs to. Work. Ooh, ooh. He had this like perfect I have an circular inventory. cut. Seriously. On a little window, and then that one is just like. He just had a seizure in the middle of cutting. Oh, I can just take this. Boing. Yoink. You don't need this. You're clearly dead. Not that that fire seems to have done much damage to the room in general. What's up with this freaking tank? That's like the most ridiculous amount of money spent on something for something so stupid. Oh, that looks pretty cool. It's got like seahorses. I know, but he's got like one goldfish in there that, and what looks like what could possibly be a dead fish. That fish is a prince. Clearly. Prince fish. It, it, it will inherit his, his land for the full like week that it lives. What am I supposed to go to? You can open your inventory by right clicking or by clicking the right mouse button. Oop, hello. Okay, did I select it? Near the piano, some music scores are on the floor. Yep, see? Papers. Let us examine oh the crumpled scores that have fallen off the piano. Why? You like music? Oh. oh. Zoom. Music notes! Zoom technology. Seriously. Someone perfected script for a Zoom function and was just like, we need to put this in something. Is there a reason I'm looking? Nothing of interest here. Oh, no. okay. These nice. sooty prints were left by a tiny hand. I don't a understand tiny. why or these music dealing with a midget sort. or a child. It's possible. Maybe a midget child. Ooh, ooh. A child midget. First person In, mode. Like tiny little hands. Move your character. You press know, left pursue. shift. Press R to switch to point and click mode. Whoa! Oh, oh, oh Good neat. Good talk to the prince fish. The fish prints. The fresh prints. Hello, fishies! See, there's another fish in there. Yeah, but he's dead. He's, no, he's like not. been chilling there the whole time. He hasn't he's moved at all. Camouflaged. His tote's dead. He's camouflaged. Anything else you want me to do, game? The tutorial Dr. isn't allowing me to. Oh, maybe I'm supposed to. Watson! Oh my god, I move forward with the left click. I straight up move forward with left click. Maybe I'm not supposed to. Watson, my dear boy, come here. Come here and look examine at the glass. Look at No, don't look at that. Look at that. He won't look at anything. No, it's look, look at uh, look at the painting. Nope. Not that painting. Yeah, the painting. Yeah, that one. No, not that one. Okay, hang on. I think we're supposed to do it in this Job. direction. There we go, <laughs> like Jesus. A brisk walk. By pressing space, you activate Sherlock Holmes' sixth sense. It will show you. Oh, hello. You now search for other clues in the room. Oh my God! Whoa. Okay, wait. Can I do this right. in this room? The fire field? started here, just beneath the bell pull. Whoever pulled the cord Is would have had his feet in the fire. I don't know. Unless it was. I thought I saw something flicker over by the painting. Started. Me too. Strange. There are some objects here that have been knocked over. It's crazy. Strange. It's very it, strange. It's very strange considering there's a freaking fire, yeah. Sherlock. All of the items have been knocked over the that's on the mantle. The thief knocked but only over some. the stool, yeah. some of which all. then caught fire. But why didn't he try to put the fire out at once? Because he was breaking and entering? I don't know. Why would he want to? Footprints. You are not going to get on your knees to examine them. There is no need. It is soot. The servants must have oh. trodden in it while they were putting out the fire. 
reasonable guess. The chest Just wasn't open. Shut. The necklace wasn't in it. Well, I mean, you know, it's kind of hard to stand here and be like, hmm, where's the necklace, huh? What's, what's, you already looked at all these? Yeah, these are green, because I looked at them. Hello, my lady. Hello, madame. You didn't Hello. Those documents are not very interesting, even though they're addressed to the Minister of Maritime Affairs. The Marquis himself. Marquis! Marquis! <laughs> Marquis. Damn it, Watson, are you The Marquis himself. The Marquis. Aren't you supposed to be a blogger or something? Yeah, I know, seriously. I'm supposed to be able to write fantastically. This oh, craft screen makes an ideal hiding place. Yeah. As the theft was but he didn't use night, it. I conclude that the thief hid himself behind the draft screen and waited until he was alone in the room. Or while everyone was putting out the fire, he just freaking went, Alright, see you guys later, bitches. Look, you can look at the door. I can't. Oop, hello. Strange. There aren't Strange. any prints. Yet I'm sure that the thief hid here. He probably didn't. Also, what is that fruit that has like two polys? See that? Lime? Yeah, it's got like two polys. Yeah, that's alright. It's just a lime. Wait, can I actually Not very oh, I can well. look at the fish? See? Aquarium. Not it's very well. Fish I told you it was dead! He's not dead. See, you and Sherlock are stupid. He's when dead. He isn't moved. He's just fish. floating. I like look how he's him. like See, he's a dead. not very well kept aquarium. Do you see what this is built out of? It's got freaking gold holding it in there, dude. Dude, bro, the is really fish. wasting When the servants <laughs> arrived at the door, having been <laughs> alerted by the bell, they saw evidence of the theft and the fire, but they didn't see the thief. This door is very hard to force. The Marquis is the only person to- Marquis! Marquis. The thief could not- I Marquis. swear it's Marquis. Until eventually- I'm pretty when the sure door was it's Marquis. Because the they're British and they said it, and- I guess so. What do you think British. Holmes? Let us search the room they live before in the British. police get here. We oh, might I have throw to keep some looking. light onto all this. We might th throw some light onto all light. this. Light! Well, I searched that. Perhaps he hid under the piano. All oh, the hello. windows are locked. They've not been forced. Oh well, that's all the windows are. <laughs> Did you get that, Sherlock? That one was blue. No shit, Sherlock. Hey, we can officially use that, and it makes sense. What about this? Can he have hit? That behind is a couch. Here? I wanted him like to see if maybe he could have hit behind there. Well, you know, I think this is quite lovely. This view. Can I? What was that? Oh, oh, hello. I can. I needed to see it what I was missing. Must have fallen from the chandelier. <laughs> He's just standing there, staring straight <laughs> ahead as he says this. Mr. Holmes. <laughs> You're already here. Good morning, I am. Inspector. You've arrived just in time. <laughs> Scotland Yard arrives like the cavalry, always in the nick of time. <laughs> ah. I don't know if that's Scotland something. Scotland Yard. That's my expression, Mr. Holmes. Have you already solved the case? Just, have you done the work it's for us yet? Possible. We can <laughs> trace the thief's rather unusual no. footsteps. B he is a true acrobat. But what I cannot understand is that when the servants entered the room, there was no one to be seen. An acrobat, perhaps, but an invisible one. Seriously, Watson? I do not think so. You really the going with invisible is acrobats? The escaped before the servants arrived. Invisible. I don't know how, but there is no other way. Half a point for the doctor, nil for the inspector. <laughs> I'm pleased to see that you find the situation amusing, Mr. Holmes. Very well then. Explain. I feel like he, that was a Dr. pity Watson point for Watson. Was when he mentioned acrobatics, but he is mistaken about the nature of the acrobat. Well, of as course, for you, no Baines, one's invisible. You're quite incorrect, as the thief was in the room when the servants Baines. entered. Explain, he looks like a Slytherin. Mr. Holmes. Watson, he would be a Slytherin. How could a thief be missed in the middle of eight men? I don't know, because he is He's very one small. of them. <laughs> Stop teasing us, Holmes. Exactly. Because he is small, small. Ah, it's ah, a child. I told you. You're thinking of a midget monkey. child and a trained monkey at that. Oh no, it was a, a monkey. A Leon top told you. A child midget. <laughs> the animal had been hidden <laughs> inside the room for several hours. This is great. Awaiting the story. I don't know if they've ever had to do anything with a monkey, but monkeys are like never calm. They're fucking monkeys. The monkey. That it was, time it was to calmly awaiting a signal from its trained. master. It's a fucking monkey. The monkey emerged from his hiding place and used the point of a diamond to open the glass cabinet the fucking monkey and steal the necklace. He headed days. across to the window by the chimney. How would he know? Stoop, How would he have known exactly where to go? How would you tell a monkey fire. you go to the that? Monkey jumped from Use the, the diamond by swinging from the bell pull, thus alerting the house servants. 
He then went to the window and began to use his diamond to cut a hole. Which was interrupted by the staff trying to gain entry via the door, and he panicked. Did again. we move? He ran My across goodness. the piano, scattering the music scores onto this the floor adventure game. before hiding inside the chandelier, knocking over a candle. Oh my! Finally, <laughs> so he the hid the chandelier. The entered the room, leaving Marcus. the door open while they put out the fire. Marcus. It was during the confusion that our agile little thief made his escape through the doorway. A simple. As that. I think a this actor should do ASMR. Bravo, Holmes. And the necklace? I I'm can see it from here, my friends. It's right in front of us. We have searched the room from top to bottom, Holmes. How were we unable to find it? Because we paid insufficient attention to the only victim of this affair. What the victim? fish tank? No one is dead. The yes, fish tank. Watson, a poor goldfish whose destiny was to die. Crushed by one of the most precious necklaces in England. The blue diamond? Oh wait, no, that's something the else entirely. The aquarium is just beneath the chandelier. I understand. The little oh, really? monkey had likely hung the necklace so around the bit... side. Yeah, it's a little off to the side. The chandelier. The jewels fell into the aquarium, where they remain now. And shall forever remain. Ew. And my shirt will come out completely. Yeah, he... Oh, okay. Well, that just popped up out no of nowhere. It's so unimpressed. He's just like, yeah, that was fucking easy. Now it is glued to your hand. Marquis, here is your necklace. Marquis. Intact. Just a little wet. That man looks Mr. way Holmes, too young for that mustache. Demonstration does credit to your reputation. It's you weren't there for the brilliant... Do you wish to verify the authenticity of your jewel? No, I recognize it. I have spent many hours admiring it, you know. I don't know if you want to admit that. And... Inspector, a bank has just been held up. You must follow me at once. Orders of Scotland Yard. Oh, well, at least we tied it up here. I thought Scotland Yard was in the Sirs, right? duty calls. My regards. Well, just one member of Scotland Yard. Well done, oh, there's many of them? Scotland like Yard is the police force. Oh. Yeah. You know how we call it? a dumb name for police force. <laughs> 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 it's not even well, Scotland. <laughs> a good day to and where's I the don't yard? know why they call it Scotland Yard. Please tell me, anybody that's watching. Why do they call it Scotland Yard? What is the point of being called Scotland Yard? Is it still called Scotland Yard, actually? That is the question. Or is it just called the police? I don't know. Oh my. Watson looks like he's about to, like, have a stroke or something. <laughs> you see the tea just running over yes. his face. This newspaper. Holmes, have you read this article about you? Oh, Holmes. No, Watson, not yet. And I won't have time to. Uh -oh. Read it before you leave. It's outrageous. If you insist. Outrageous. Um, we have to read it now. No, don't read well, it. Well, uh, let's take a look around. Spite him. Go look at the couch. Look at the couch, I say. Look at the couch? Okay. That is a, that's nice, a nice couch. couch. I'm not even sure if that's a couch. That's like, it's a, like a sofa. What's the difference? Um, Can you look in the magnifying glass? Oh! Oop. No? I was trying to jump. Kind of? It doesn't really magnify anything. No, not really. It <laughs> it's a useless dirty. magnifying glass. Right, what now. What is that in here? Hello? Oh my. Someone needs this is obviously Sherlock's room. Is it? Oh yeah, look at how messy it is. bed is all not made. Yeah, it's Sherlock. Oh my, he cracked the mirror. I didn't know you were that ugly with Sherlock. Also, I don't have a reflection. Is that a mustache on that mannequin? It is. Mannequin has a mustache. All men must have mustaches. Can mustache I just mention eye. that Sherlock is a fucking vampire? Oh, hello. It's people birds. outside. Rats with wings. They are rats with wings. My violin! Watson's like, make sure you read this newspaper. And I'm like, yeah, I'll get to it later. <laughs> I must Wait, explore. Look at the chessboard. It must be set in a certain pattern. Um, Messy. I like it. Sherlock. Nike. Very Nike. What's oh, this is obviously Watson. Wow, they're both pigs. <laughs> Damn it, Watson. Why does Sherlock has like a double bed and Watson's like in the this corner? Is, uh, this is a shadowy part. Did he pee the bed? <gasps> Did he? <gasps> Watson! <laughs> Watson, I know your secret. You peed the bed again. <laughs> Why is your dick that far down? <laughs> he curls That's up the at the foot question. of the bed. He curls up at the foot of the bed and then pees. And he has a dog like laying on the bed. Then he gets in one of those latex the strand dog suits. magazine. 
I shall go no further with that conversation. What? To make your character move faster. Thank you. Look, there's people outside. Stare at them. Wait, 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 wait. We must lose. The guy over there. He's just standing there. He was facing. Oh, they are animated. See? I yeah. was saying. These black. These roses are quite frightening. All right, let's read the bloody newspaper. That's not a newspaper. <laughs> This is whatever. Sherlock Holmes at the home of Marques of Mark Conangam. The investigation is a fiasco. Mark Yesterday, the celebrated detective Sherlock Holmes was invited to the manor of Marques of Conangam to supply his conclusions following his investigation into the disappearance of the priceless Samoan necklace. It should be recalled that the lady called in the detective after the police appeared flummoxed in the face of the astonishing circumstances surrounding the theft. Indeed, the valuable piece of jewelry disappeared while the door to the room in which it was displayed was locked. The alarm was raised by the servants, alerted by the room's service bell ringing out during the night. When the Marquis? Marquis? Uh, is it really Marquis? Somebody somebody Marquis. who knows this word, tell us. Marquis? The only person in possession of the key opened the door. Everyone rushed in to extinguish a fire that had started before it was noticed that the necklace had mysteriously vanished. My god, there's so much reading. Oh my goodness. As usual, Mr. Holmes resolved the case in the twinkling of an eye and the jewel was recovered. I will not waste my time on the various explanations as to the disappearance because I would prefer to draw your attention, dear readers, to the last surprising developments in the case. Following the departure of Sherlock Holmes, who placed the necklace in the safe himself, the Marquis noticed that the jewel was nothing but a poor copy of the original. Let it not be forgotten that the Samoan necklace, although plain and without ornament, is unique because of the rarity of its pearls, pearls which are found only in a small part of the lagoon of the archipelago of the same name, and to which scientists attribute their exceptional... Jesus Christ! The Marquess grandfather and an eminent explorer would have been should have been part of her daughter's dowry for her marriage to the duke of newcastle so i'm not going i am going to place a simple question should we not in all open-mindedness ask ourselves that the necklace was not simply and deliberately exchanged for a fake by mr holmes himself i am aware dear readers that the brutality of this question without any preconceptions may certainly shock some of you but the facts are there and our thoughts and judgments should not be confused with the regard with which we are blah 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 at the time, we did not hesitate to consider a tacit complicity on the part of the latter. For those who are familiar with Mr. Holmes, it is quite apparent that his character traits show more of, an, of the opportunist and brilliant usurper than that of a... <sighs> to the suggestion that the description of this gentleman provided by his friend, Dr. John Watson, through his stories, is a long way away from the truth. How much fucking huh? text. Jesus Christ. There's a lot. Uh, replacing Inspector Lestrade, who is currently convalescent and a habi an habitual abuser of narcotics such as heroin and cocaine. It is important to disregard Sherlock Holmes' good reputation in order to form an objective opinion and to ask the pertinent questions. Why has he stolen nothing before now and only this necklace? That is a really stupid question. To be continued. It is up to you, dear readers, to form your own opinions, but you can count upon your humble servant. Servant, could we not have just typed out something that kind of got the idea across? The ancestry, the Lord's Committee. How? <gasps> My goodness. Prince well, Wilfield, that was French quite rude. French expert and bagpipe <laughs> player might be our next king. That's not so shocking, my dear fellow. <laughs> he you doesn't know, care at all. To which article I'm referring, Holmes? <laughs> he doesn't care at all. How can Farley dare to tarnish your reputation like that? You know, Watson, that wherever Falling glory asleep. walks, jealousy Woo. is bound to follow. Are you As done reading? The of the necklace, <laughs> I suspect that we shall soon be enlightened in this regard. Uh... Come in, Inspector Baines. The door's open. Oh, my. How did you know? <laughs> Who opened oh, the door? Mr. Holmes. Find out next time. How did you know I was here? On Dragon How Ball you know I was here? Mr. Holmes. Huh? Who avoids the second to last step this guy of the stairs, hat which creaks is... dreadfully. And if I add the clinking of the handcuffs at your It does belt, not fit him. To what do we owe the no, not really. It's, weird. It's, 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 it's quite like small. Back. It's not quite a bowler hat, and it's not really a fedora. It's like the extension of his head. It's In like if you head. took off the Can rim, you explain this it would slander. be his head. Has the necklace of the Samoas really been replaced by a fake? I, I mean, the guy didn't really even look at it to begin with. It's true. Wasn't it necklace, always a fake, then? I wouldn't permit myself to question true. the integrity and honesty of Mr. Holmes. The necklace is a forgery? Impossible! I saw the Marquis authenticated before my very eyes, before Holmes returned it to its before place. My I'm sure you did, Marquis Watson. Osmond Osmond Farley's my theory. Face. 
I shouldn't be surprised if the reporter isn't behind all this slander about I'm you. I'm never surprised. He's a freelancer, well known for his explosive and subjective articles. Well, that obviously case, means everyone is going to believe all his words and no proof. Because that's how it works. Like that. Now, I'm more interested in the guy in the background. Homes. I'm he's sure this life has story. no trouble in Where taking apart from? this theory. Does he have children at home? Probably. Such are they his? Oh. On their own, like one of or Mrs. are they the next door neighbors? Let us leave the police to solve this problem. Find out next time. <laughs> <to the laughs> look at him. Yeah, look at him. He's just like right out of it. I assume that you have the fake necklace with you. It's why you're here. Your superiors would like me to examine it. What's up with his nose? Indeed. Like I don't know. Would like Maybe it was broken? Or deny putting this fake in the like, box. this guy's not saying anything. Can't that wait. Around. I must go to the house of Lord Peregrine Maitland, the Bishop Peregrine. of Knightsbridge. Lord Penguin. Mark Younes. She is okay. beside herself. Without the necklace, her marriage Martians? is compromised. It is the principal item of a young woman's dowry. Is that all that matters? The dowry? A lovely marriage. <laughs> Thank you, Watson. Holmes, Examine. forgive me for insisting. But don't you I don't think I can deal with those helmets. Jewelry? Wow, that Straps nose is quite the nose. It's out of the question that I arrive late. This doesn't work out. It will only take you a couple of minutes. You really must quell the suspicions put forward in this appalling article. If you will allow me, Inspector, be my guest. Very I guess well. we're just I going to look at it. Bitch. What yep. do you think, Holmes? Oh, did I not look at it? I don't oh, know. I'm over is. here, asshole. Oh, okay. Find out if the necklace is authentic or not. All right. This Hello. pearl is a different Made color. in China. <laughs> oh, these pearls aren't these even the right pearls colors. These are of poor quality. Well, this is obviously no, not real. <laughs> Wait, it just says made in China right there. Oh, that would be amazing. Let's see. What else? Okay, I accidentally put it back down. Oh, God. Is that these it? Three. Yeah, 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 yeah. I guess that's all that really matters is, you know. <laughs> Those three are made of wood. Yeah, seriously. The guy looked at it and he's like, this is completely authentic. Yep. Oh, this hello. This pearl is too small. It is not in its place here. Too many Obviously. defects. This necklace is a fake. This is nothing but a vulgar copy. And at a glance, it would appear that the forger has intended for it to be seen as such. How could we have been fooled by such a I mean, it is pretty damn obvious that it's fake. I don't understand. Yes. How is it possible? <laughs> Holmes, uh, do you have a theory about this? Public education? I have yeah. no <laughs> insisted that I examine the necklace, and I have done so. Now it is important that I keep my appointment. I'm sure, Inspector, that you will throw some light on this affair. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Whose affair? His you affair? You may accompany me, Watson, if you care to do so. Goodbye, oh, my gentlemen. goodness. He I'll is, like, so snarky. This is amazing. Goodbye, Inspector. Watson is just going to stick his finger Bishop, right up your butthole and walk right behind you. Home? <laughs> yes, the Bishop of Knightsbridge. I put his address on our map of London on my desk. Would you get it for me, please? I guess I'm All Watson right, now. Holmes. Yep, yep. I just, I left you from his face. You control Dr. Watson. I, I, I jumped from uh, Sherlock's I face to... Okay, what, what just happened? I jumped from many people's faces. Possessing people. Diocese of Knightsbridge. And you teleport as this demon. Yes, oh my. Whoa, on your way so soon. The police, already? This guy looks Amish. How did you know? May we see the Bishop of Knightsbridge? Yes. Yes, of course. They aren't the police. But come in. I mean, we may as well be. Sherlock Holmes and Dr. Watson. Or what Rentlock happened, Holmes then? and Mon what? Watts I, I don't know. It was last night. I Sherlock Holmes just and arrived. guacamole. <laughs> and I made this macabre discovery. My God. Macabre. How horrible. Is that the painting in the background? Probably the guy we came to see. Except that I do Holmes. believe... Yeah, there he is. The bishop. Appallingly mutilated. How what? dreadful. Mutilated. Okay. And killed. What? <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm, killed? you know... And killed? It's better to be uh, He's barely alive recognizable and mutilated. Now. How could any of God's children be responsible for that? You they clearly have been very sheltered. Children, now do please try to calm yourself <laughs> and focus, because we will need your assistance. Do you have any idea as to the motive behind this? I oh haven't my. had time to do an inventory, but nothing appears to have been stolen. Money. And anyway, His Excellency didn't own anything Drugs. of great value. I mean, you could I probably pawn those curtains. Note this down, please, Doctor. 
You'd kill a bishop for d- mo- drugs, this? money, and women? No, Reverend. Nothing was stolen. I am Sherlock Holmes. Would you Holmes, not? And this is Dr. Watson. We yeah, are here I would. At the request of the bishop. No, I wouldn't. In that case, I, I must ask you. That was See, weird. Because you know, <laughs> because you know <laughs> it's <laughs> true, and you're trying not to. I know I wouldn't. Today. That's all I know. Reverend, when the inspectors uh. of Scotland Yard find themselves at a dead end, which they quite often do, I assure you, <laughs> then they turn to me for help. If you allow us to continue our investigation, Watson in the background. then you shall have Snarky the Snarky as ever! Narcissism. Out of the question. <laughs> I didn't know you. I'm going to call the police. Whether See, he doesn't know them. How did he it know that? Wait a minute, everyone, yeah. Reverend, if you Ah, the police are ready? Watson, are you taking notes? This I don't know you. Let me call the police. One. Therefore, we must not overlook the slightest detail. Wait, yes. so Holmes, if I he knows that we're not police, then why at the beginning was he like, please, already? One thing we can be sure of at the moment is that this crime is not for gain. Obviously. The Reverend has informed us that nothing valuable can I have was stolen. Some, but I that he knows of. It would seem Here. that the bishop had nothing of any the worth to Watson. take. He said, the good, Watson, he said. The Watson? Yeah. The Watson. <laughs> the wattage. All right, let's see what. Oh, oh. Investigate, investigation into the Bishop of Knightsbridge. The bishop didn't own anything of value, not even in his safe. Okay. Let me Good. zoom that in for you. Oh, let's, shit. Let's go look you at control his... Sherlock Holmes. Yeah, let's go look at him. Whoa. That is pretty Just nasty. go up to him and, like, tickle him. Yep, he's <laughs> dead. He's definitely dead. Wait, I need it. Oh, my God. Look at his fingers. <laughs> what happened here was this was, uh, this is when they first started the game. Uh-huh. They uh, outsourced the art. And they came back with this for uh, Sherlock Holmes. And they were like, what are we going to do with this? What kind of bullshit is this? What did they make? Moral of the story, don't outsource work. Oh, ew, ew. His chest has been lacerated, I would say, with a very sharp and fine blade. Yes, it it has. It's kind of dull to me. (laughs) You can see by his expression that he suffered terribly. Did they take out his eyes? And I can make out strips of skin between his teeth. Does that mean he tried to bite someone? He doesn't have eyes. Do we want to focus on that? Also, can I can I scroll? Grab him and throw him on the floor. Is that it? That's all there is to explore about this? No, just slowly go down. Oh, shit. I can't. <laughs> How do we get out of this? Oh, wait. Six cents. Oh, here we go. Ugh. That is mm. exactly what the I wanted. The fingers have been crushed and violently struck. You think? They're the very unnatural. Been... Okay, thank you. The fingers have been crushed. In his nightgown. Clearly. What is wrong with his feet? They burned it. Oh, God, they burned him! Terrible. Did no one hear him screaming? There's a the finger. finger. Ew. Apparently it doesn't belong to the Bishop of Knightsbridge. <laughs> How <laughs> dreadful. Not his finger. <laughs> Well, we now have a finger. His feet have been burned. What's that over there? Hmm. My first I'll go to that in a second. Wears a size nine shoe. Are you, you? serious? Wow. But what does it matter, Holmes? I Everything it matters. Size eight for him. All right. Well, I'm so glad that we were able to look into this. Wait, is there more to see here? Oh, oh, oh! oh wait, wait. A piece of rope. It was okay, used well, to tie up. I don't know where I picked that up. Yeah, I think I did. Saw it in the background. This oh. poor man was tied just below the knees. To stop him from walking, certainly, but mostly to free his feet. My you think? God, Holmes, this man was horribly tortured. What gave it away? The mutilated flesh? We're not done. Clearly. All right, Continue. did I get everything from here? Yes, I did. I did not get... Okay. <laughs> That's just his fingers. All right, let's his see. forearms oh. have been ripped. Pieces of skin have been torn off. What do you think, Watson? This is I getting say gruesome. That he was eaten alive. Ew. I noticed a curious degeneration of the skin tissue around the wounds. My dear friend, everything points to this man having gnawed at his own forearms. That's what? That's unbelievable, Holmes. It's been tied there for days. Oh, God. Well, who would... What? That can't be right, because someone... Oh, sh- surely that's, would have noticed. That's why he had skin in his teeth. Yep, he was eating his own arms. That is... That is nasty. That is his just nasty. His stomach is covered in scratches. Quite evidently, they weren't made recently. So, what? these wounds were not made by his murderers. Who on earth would have made them? What is this? This is meant to look supernatural, isn't it? Like, it's meant to look violent and as angry. And, huh? As always. 
clearly. Something is missing here. Oh yes, and what might that be? His Possibly life. his eyes. <laughs> his shoes are missing. What? This stove is filled to overflowing. Yeah, probably where they put his feet, dip. A broken bottle of whiskey. However, the Bishop of Knightsbridge was known that's for the his real sobriety. Shame here. Well, I would assume that he was sober. I think that's a that's kind of a rule in religion. You can't really drink alcohol except for the blood of Christ. A bottle of whiskey. I can huh. make out fingerprints stained with blood and dirt. It would well, seem obviously. that the brutes who tortured the bishop to death were intoxicated with alcohol. You think so? A broken vial and blood near the neck. What a picked up quite smell. a bit. Chemical components. I How can you smell it from all the way over there? You have a magical the nose. Of Peregrine Maitland, Look at that tiny hand. This is very Garden. tiny. <laughs> this little baby hand. The Bishop of Knightsbridge has the same name as his ancestor, an illustrious <laughs> family. Oh my. Ooh, this hello. Is the hand I that looks like. My butt. Wait a second. That kind of looks like the markings on his chest. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, Reverend, yeah, let's I'm get out of here. I'm something, an implement with which to open this chest. Could you tell me where to find it? No, <laughs> go to the devil. It had a what what the hell? Forward. Reverend, what is inside the chest? chest? I'm not afraid of anything. In fact, I do have the necessary implements. But if I have to give them to anyone, it will be to a representative of the law and no one else. I am a representative of the law, you freak. Apparently you have no doctor. right to search here. I have every right. Keep searching. I shall. I'm obviously trying to help, you piece of scum. Okay, I just pick that up, whatever. There isn't any I can doubt. use this later. The wounds on the bishop were administered with this scum. I'm like swaying back and forth. I noticed. It's very strange. Well, we'll go in there in a minute. I think there's still more to see in this horrific room of appalling death and destruction. Death destruction. Right, well, we looked at that. There is blood Ooh, no. on this paperweight. This yeah. paperweight was used to crush the victim's fingers. Are you serious? They crushed his fingers with a freaking paperweight. That's his fingers were paper. Hello. A whip. A made of paper. No. A whip. It is a discipline for self-flagellation. Oh yeah. Oh. You oh, can't that's fart. where this is from. So you're is not allowed to fart. It's the It's that a cilice huh? designed to bruise the person wearing it. No. The bishop wore it as repentance. You, you know what these are for, this yes? Very pious man. Must have had the habit of mortifying his flesh yes. as a means of repentance. There we go. Basically, you use these to whip yourself, oh. and this is like a bunch of spikes. Uh, yeah. Well, I was also giving that for their sake. I'm sure, you knew. Uh, Self flatulence. All right, so I could probably use the thing I just picked up, huh? No. Maybe I'm supposed to. Ew. That's rope. That's a scalpel. Can I use this? Oop. Stab the guy and take the. This door has not been forced. Where does it lead, Reverend? To His Excellency's room. There is just a mattress. Well, now you're being stool. compliant. There is just a mattress and a stool. There might also be answers. The bishop's bedroom. It is very austere. Yeah, I know. How, how does a man not freeze to fucking death in here? It is impossible to get out. Well, I mean, well, yes. Good, good deduction, Holmes. There is like nothing. How does the man not freeze? Jesus. This room is like so elegantly decorated. It looks so lovely. Except for crack yeah, except for the crack. crack. This beautiful wooden bookshelf. Look at this design and beauty. And then you go into his room and it was just like you know, there's mold on the walls. It's a teeny tiny window. He freezes to death, but his cushion is quite nice. <laughs> it's the only thing that's like really nice in here is his fucking cushion. That, oh, I thought that candle was something exciting. Shh. <laughs> I understand. I don't need to His run in here. The door hasn't been forced. Strange. Reverend, might I have the key? No. Now. You have no authority here. Let me call the police. Perhaps we should listen to him, Holmes. Oh, Perhaps oh. you should let me get on with this, Watson. Just kicks the door open. Closed. All right, what are we doing now? I think I've pretty much looked at everything. You have no right to search Oh, him. shut up. What should we do next, Holmes? Okay, well, I don't know. <laughs> oh, deduction. The bishop's shoes are missing. The veranda wasn't searched. The murderers were looking for something. The bishop took the murderers by surprise. 
The murderers got the wrong person. They were looking for something specific. Well, it's got to be that one. I don't imagine that it would have been anything it was else. It's the shoes. Okay. Chest. The murderers were unable to open the safe. The victim was savagely tortured. Okay, here we go. The bishop was mortifying himself. He was used to pain. The bishop resisted torture, punished himself too severely, couldn't stand being tortured. So he must have resisted the torture because they sure as hell beat the fuck out of that guy. Mm. Oh, here we go. The murderers came here to kill the bishop. The bishop's murderers got what they wanted and they didn't get what they wanted. I think that's it. Oh, hey, those two we got correct. Does that mean I didn't get this one? No. Wow. Well. I have no freaking idea. Maybe it's because we didn't read the book all the way. What do you mean, the, the newspaper? It's a joke. Oh. I cannot leave. Well, I don't know what else. Oh. What were wow. you putting your feet, Watson? Have you noticed these prints upon the ground? That's what I was missing! Well, yes, those muddy marks. See here, Watson. Footprints can often provide more vital information than the very best of informants. Yes. So we're going you know to use the magnifying glass. It's child's play, Watson. We will begin oh, yeah, by excluding the contaminating prints, which are yours and mine from where we came in, and those of our dear Reverend, who was so impatient to call the police. Yes, of course. Well, uh, let's see. We're gonna. This one Size is. Size nine. Oh my. What is that? Size nine. Also size nine. Size nine and a half. My god. Size nine. Why are they all size nine? Size nine. Oh god. Size nine and a half. So this is nine and a half, and this is nine and a half. Nine, 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 nine. Nine, nine, nine. Click the questions at the top. This print came from an expensive pair of shoes, and it seems recent. It is not a laborer's shoe. So does that mean it's neither of ours? Hello. A fragment of stone. Peculiar. Um, so Well-worn shoes with an odd pattern on the soles. Hobnail boots like those worn by laborers. Hobnail boots. Hobnail. Hobnail. Okay. Just wanted to see if they were all like that. How many criminals were there? One. Uh, one, two. Did you say two? Why two? Wait, maybe three? One, two, well, three, one, four, which... five. Uh... There's so three this people. is a nice shoe. That's gonna be the bishop guy. Yeah. And then... And then you gotta exclude you and Watson. Yeah. Uh, question two. What do the footprints reveal? Oh my god. All men left the room jumping on one <laughs> leg. <laughs> it's legit. was carried so as not to leave footprints. One man left the room wearing Strange, different shoes. But true. One of the crooks was wearing a different pair of shoes. I did not deduce that from all of this. Obviously, the bishop was missing his shoes. Yeah. All right, how many criminals were there? Well, there is one, two, three, four, five, six pairs of sh shoe prints. This is nine, and it's very nice. This is also a nine. This is a nine. Nine the and nice a half, shoe. nine and a half, and this one. The nice shoe on the bottom is actually the dead bishop. Yeah, so that would have to be another villain. So this is one, at the very least. Then... I think this one, or I think, wait a minute. Well-worn shoes with an odd pattern on the soles. Hobnail boots like those worn by laborers. Laborer, so two, that's Hobnail two, right? Hobnail boots like those worn by laborers. Hobnail boots, hobnail. I say three? Nothing of what interest do you think? here. Uh, why three? I don't know. I really don't. Two, three. Sounds reasonable. Perfect. We have three <laughs> Therefore, we have three. It just felt like the right number. Left again. Well, but two one is of them was wearing a different. Uh oh, I hope that was actually right, and it wasn't just like.
So, Assuming we have to you know, like how some games will be like, yes, that's exactly. Like mm. Italian shoes. So you my no logic is there wasn't one guy because there was asking Let us look how many, and it'd be really dull to be one. It won't be two because that's kind of like a butt buddy situation where they love each other. <laughs> so the good balance would be three, because if you had four, that's just a fucking gangbang. So yeah. three, that makes sense. Yeah, three is a nice. Normal number. So I, I assumed one of the murderers left wearing the bishop, bishop's shoes. One of the murderers sells shoes. The murderers <laughs> are poor. Oh my. The murderer searched for the bishop's shoes, wanted to steal from the bishop. This doesn't seem right. Also, Obviously, the green. murderers looked for something specific. That's what I want. No, that doesn't make any sense. Wanted to steal from the bishop? Were hired by... Oh, there we go. It is evident that the bishop of Knightsbridge's no killers clicking. were after something specific. <laughs> they didn't yeah, know what you were clicking on. No. And the last one you're just like... Nah, nah, nah. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's the one I was doing. The item about. they were seeking must still be inside. It is unlikely that they will let this matter rest. They will most certainly return to finish what they started. And, and you'll be you next. More, the chest is locked and shall remain so. Very yeah, well. We have reached an impasse. You are a stubborn man, Reverend. Watson, accompany our friend to the police station and return with Inspector Baines. Baines and no one else. I shall wait for you here. Go. <laughs> Alone at last. Now I can continue my investigation. <laughs> yes, Alone. Okay. So, what is it you... What? The doors. Okay, we're gonna just stand here for a minute. I need something. Nope. The room. I need something. Back to the room. Wait, he needs I an need item. Some. Okay. This lock should be easy. To <laughs> I had a feeling see. it was one of the sharp, pointy objects. Oh my god! What? Okay. Right. Um. Um. Yes. No. Uh. Okay. Wait. 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 Oh wait. 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 I get. It. I get. It. I get it. Okay. Okay. Yes. That's not right. Starting. What do you mean? I get it. Oh wait, wait, wait. Okay, okay. I know. I know what I'm sort of supposed to do. So one, two, uh, three. Oh yeah, that's right there. It's in the picture. There, there we, go. we are. Yeah. It is simplicity itself. Yay! I did it! I did it! I did something very simple. There anything much in this room. It must be used as a reading or meditation room. One would think. So. Oh, hello. Dead bird. An ink stain, quite ink fresh. Stain. This stain bird. is just on the edge of the rug. Oh Whoa. God! Why I teleported? There is nothing on the floor, yet the ink must have soaked through the rug. It did, which means the rug was moved. There is nothing on the floor. Okay, good job. The rug was moved from one place. He comes back. How did you get in there? You uh. This inkwell key. was tipped over recently. Oh, but the it's carpet broken. was moved. An the ink stain. Moved. The ink stain on the floor comes from the ink on the rug, but they are not in the same place. Someone has moved the rug recently. Where's the ink stain? That is curious. Uh, the ink stain was on the other end. It was like floor. over here. Certain yeah, stones have been marked out. It just oh, like it did, but we didn't see it on the floor, which didn't make any sense. I know, this... but you'll see what I mean in the, when you edit. The ink stain was gone on the back of the rug. Wait, was it? Yeah. Oh, that I thought I saw curious. it on the back of the rug. There is oh. something strange on the floor. Certain stones have been marked oh, no. out, just like a chessboard. If I, I have to play something. chess, I swear to God. <laughs> oh, hello. Apparently, someone wanted <laughs> to hide this statue. Hmm. This horse. All right. Well, okay. There you go, Sherlock. There is a message the underneath this statue. Let's see. Oh God! What a lack of imagination. Use your passion for chess. Last square on which the knight will place himself, after having covered all the others, will be the right one. I love you. What? Don't worry about it. <laughs> Alright, so the last... Just go what? ahead and place that pony on the board, would you? <laughs> the last square on which the knight will place himself, after having covered all the others, Will be the right one. This message was written by a woman. But what? For whom was it intended? Interesting, this chess game. Right, can we talk about your deduction on that? 
Um, <laughs> hello. Okay, good. <laughs> I was just chilling in the corner. I'm sure it smells quite badly on here. In exactly. here. Is curious. The bishop is I closing need... it with his spirit. Uh, oh, wait, I think I know. Rogue de horse. Huh? Rogue de horse. Uh, keep going. You gotta go to all of them. Yeah, but you can only move it the way up it can it normally moves. Wait, that's right there. I know very little about chess, but I know enough to make it work. Okay. I don't know what they're trying to make you do. I That's not right. Start again. <laughs> oh, I fucked myself over. <laughs> oh, I fucked myself That's over. Not right. Hold on. Go. Uh-huh. Go there. There. Go to this one. This one. Go to this one. This one. Go to that one. Nah. Go to that one. Go to that one. That one? Mm, don't know if that was right. <laughs> well, I'm sure I could figure something out from this. Nah, yeah, that's you. Yep. Oh. That's not right. I almost Stop did it. Again. I almost got it. Yeah, do some kind of pattern. That's not right. You have to yeah. do all the edges. Wait. Okay, now, now, now I gotta figure this out. But hey, this is pretty good. It's a pattern. Let's do... Yes? Mm, I guess so. The hell if I know. I'd have to sit down with a piece of paper and figure it out. Okay, this is looking pretty good. I swear to God, if I figure it out, I will be very excited. As long as it's a pattern, it'll, it'll work. I think you got it. Yeah! Oh, oh baby! All on my it own! It will have to be pulled free. On your own? I need something. Oh. What do you mean, on your own? Well, with, with wonderful help from my dear Sherlock, my uh -huh. dear Breadlock Holmes. Uh -huh. <laughs> Brother that said follow patterns, huh? <laughs> on your own. I see 24th how you'll throw of me April. under the bus. My love, what a wonderful spring and what a marvelous day, our dear youngest child's birthday. Whoa! Did, did the bishop have a child? Every moment is so precious as our child blossoms, and without a doubt, he will soon be walking. Are you sure you cannot get away on Sunday after Vespers? I thought that. My darling, I know that you think I am insistent, but we absolutely must legitimize our union. We cannot live in sin all our lives. Rest assured, my dear, that I understand your position is not easy, and I cannot allow our children's future to be compromised. What is a so-called scandal next to the well-being of your family? We must become husband and wife legally to finally form a real family. Hmm. A packet of letters addressed to the Reverend. They were written by a woman who mentions his illegitimate children. Oh no. Their affair isn't official. Perfect. I have you now, my wayward Reverend. Oh my. Hmm. Oh my. Oh my indeed. What an elaborate way to hide freaking letters. They come back. Where's uh where's Scotland? Scotland oh, Yard? Wow. Watson. You were gone a terribly long time, <laughs> and Inspector Calmly Baines walks out of the room. I'm you were gone a very hurt. long time. We were unable to find him. Dr. Watson me would not to allow me to contact any inspector other than this Baines. What manners! I am a man of the church. My dear Reverend, I notice that you are a chess lover. I trust you'll excuse me, but I am never able to resist the appeal of a half-finished game. You are an expert at chess. Very well, then. What do you want now? <laughs> I have guessed. Wow, that Resolving black your small chess problem has allowed me to discover some very interesting letters. Letters? What do they say? Reverend, why hide these letters here and run the risk of the bishop finding them? Right oh, under the What's in the letters? <laughs> Not now, Watson. <laughs> Where else could I have hidden them? My own chambers are too austere. They could offer no cover. I knew, however, that His Excellency, may he rest in peace, would not notice my game. 
The contents of the Bishop of Knightsbridge's What a weird thing to program or put together. Give me the elements in, in a church. Old, like, how did he even mechanize the that? Don't worry about it. Corruption. Let the bishop know more. You are the therefore the apostolic director of the diocese, are you not? Well, yes, but only until someone else is appointed. I am hmm. certain that the Honorable Bishop of York, whom I have the privilege of knowing well enough for him to listen to what I have to say, would recognize your qualities for the post. Hmm. If I receive new responsibilities, it will be through my faith and devotion, nothing else. He's a real man of the church, except for the fact that he is an Ill illegitimate child. I am a gentleman, and it would distress me to be obliged to pass this correspondence. Oh, am I actually choosing options minutes. with which to, like, Holmes, blackmail him? I know that the end justifies the means, but allow me to express some reservations about how you are proceeding. Am I accidentally you're a gentleman, making but I hear nothing but the words of a blackmailer. The stems that you are looking for are scattered about this room. Manage by yourself. Oh. Well, sorry I pissed you off. The well. stems are hidden around the room. Oh, hello. Alright. Uh, yes. Thank you. Good, now you can stick them in the thing. Yep, but I think we need more. Oh, Jesus Christ, what just happened? What are you hey, doing? You're in a church hall. Uh, my mouse was acting funny. Is there not more? Take but perhaps through. there would be more. Hello. I knew it! I knew there was more! Alright. Check his room. Hello? What? Oh, that's just silly. Shilly? That's just shilly. Sure, sure. Hey. Oh, those were not there before. That was def Oh, you hello. Have one. Evidently, as I always do. What are you able to tell us about the Bishop of Knightsbridge's last days? I feel did like I was accidentally an asshole. Him? Did he seem worried? There's no accident about being an asshole. Do not asshole. omit the smallest detail. I His thought I was just supposed to, to go in order, like I did with Watson. Request. I found you this did it there, too. Oh. He's gonna die at the end for that. No! Do you know why that might not be? Not Were they on bad terms? I don't think so. It's rather a consequence of his work. The young man is employed within the archive section of the Royal Library doesn't leave him with a lot of free time. Do you know imagine. the reason for his summons? No. He was an asshole. The conversation was very heated. It only lasted for a few minutes Looking and ends. ended with the Nine nephew in a minutes. terrible rage. Yep. Interesting. We'll end it very I've soon answered your after questions. this. Will you now let me contact the authorities? I'm afraid not, Reverend. Not just yet. Oh my. All right. Now we can open the safe. <laughs> I feel like like <laughs> we're borderline illegal right now. <laughs> All right. We're gonna go ahead and save it here for today. I don't remember any of these saves. Yes. Cliffhanger. And we'll go ahead and see you guys next time. I hope you enjoyed this series of Sherlock Holmes, or Brentlock Holmes and Mon Watsovica. Yep. <laughs> okay, guys, we'll see you next time. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and post in the comment section below how you feel about Sherlock Holmes as a series, and if you enjoyed this video,